right, moving on to the next room of the house. Now that the dishwasher's gone and we gotta do laundry. Uh, so with laundry, most washers have some settings on them. All right, they're gonna say thing like colors, uh, maybe it has a towels loading or a heavy. So just kind of, it'll tell you what to do. All right, if you have a lot of towels, you're gonna wanna do a heavy setting. If you have a mixed low that's got colors in it, go ahead and do the color setting. Um, brand new clothes that are darker colors, so like a red or a black, you need to wash those together because that red will turn your white shirt into a pink shirt. All right, so washing machines. For the most part, water comes from the bottom again, right? It fills up that, that tub in the bottom here, gets them super wet, then the soap comes out and the washer mixes it all together. All right, all that means for you is don't load the washer too heavy, all right? Don't throw a bunch of stuff in there so that it can't move around. Also, if you throw a bunch of towels in there, when the towels get wet, it's gonna make your washer really heavy. And when it starts to spin to dry it, your washing machine is gonna start doing this. All right, and I'm not like, that's what happens, okay? So don't throw too many towels in there. Keep the loads pretty even. All right, so it's been about a half hour. The laundry's going, it's all done. So lift the lid and now we just transfer everything. All right, once you've got everything transferred, you need to clean your lint trap. Every dryer, no matter where it is or what brand it is, has a lint trap. It's usually right down here somewhere. And all you're gonna do is take all the stuff that comes off your clothes, that way it catches all that stuff and doesn't end up back in your dryer, but you gotta clean it off.